Okay, here we have got a question about quadratic graphs and equations. This is the further maths GCSE question, which is a level 2 qualification. So we've got a, a sketch of an equation, a general equation of a quadratic ax squared plus bx plus c is shown here. They're not telling you what the actual equation is, but they're telling you the minimum of the point is 2 minus 3. And that should tell us a few things about the equation. Let's have a look what they want to know. Um, so for the sketch shown, the circle Call the correct answer for each of the following. The value of a is 0, positive, or negative. Well, the value of a tells you what sort of shape this curve is. Because it's a U shape, first of all, that means it has a value, it's not 0. If it was 0, this wouldn't be a quadratic, it would be a straight line. So it would be um, a vertical, uh, diagonal line like that, or like this. But because it's um, a curve shape, it has to be a value. If it's positive, um, positive ones, oops, positive, are U shapes, which is what this one is, and negatives would be an upside down U shape, it would be turned upside down, it's like an N shape. So this is not a negative, this is a positive um, value of A. The value of C is 0, positive, or negative. Now, with the value of C, the value of C tells us um, if, if C was 0, then we wouldn't have a C part here. We could factorize out the X and you would get a zero value for the solution. So it would be coming down through zero. So we know it's not zero. Um, if that was the case, then um, when we, when we uh, add C to it, it would move the graph up. So in fact, um, it means we'd have a sort of positive value where it crosses the zero line here, but because it's down, that means that C must be negative. Okay, the solutions of um, this equation are, are they both zero and all these sort of things? Well, if this is correctly sketched, then this point, the solutions where it equals zero are where these two lines cross, where these two curves cross the x-axis. So this one crosses positive, this one crosses negative. So that's that one. Um, the number of solutions for this equal to minus 6, well minus 6 would be down here somewhere, and this equation does not equal minus 6, the lowest it goes down is minus 3, so that's 0. The equation of the tangent to this at 2 minus 3, so the tangent is the line that just touches that, carries along. Um, it's a horizontal line that goes through minus 3 on the y-axis, so y equals minus 3. Okay, one mark for each of those, I think.